Hey guys, welcome back to Chill Vibes Only. Today's video is on mindful masturbation. So how to have mindful masturbation, how to practice mindful masturbation, and how mindful masturbation can actually help increase your sex life and help you enjoy sexual experiences more. So I've talked about conscious masturbation on this channel before, um, but in conscious masturbation, I also wanted to bring your awareness to conscious thoughts. Whereas mindful masturbation and practicing mindfulness during masturbation is really about connecting to the sensations in our body and focusing just on those sensations. To practice mindful masturbation and mindfulness during masturbation, you want to start to first cultivate a practice of mindfulness in your day-to-day -day life. So mindful eating, mindful walking, um, you know, if you're having a shower, focusing on the water on your body and being super mindful of, you know, maybe when you apply lotion afterwards or when you're brushing your teeth. Practicing as much as possible, becoming aware of the sensations that you experience in your body when you do those simple tasks. Um, and then we can begin to practice being mindful when we masturbate. So when it comes to mindful masturbation, you obviously want to set aside a specific amount of time that you're going to practice this. So may it be 10, 15, 20 minutes, all the way up to an hour. It's really just however long you have time for. Uh, and I would start off by trying to eliminate any stressors or noise or anything that's going to distract you. So picking a time and place where you are fully comfortable, um, where you're not going to be disturbed and where you are going to be most at ease. So you set yourself up to be as mindful as possible. Um, so trying to eliminate any external factors that may pop up in your mind. So once you kind of create that time and space for yourself, what you'll start to do and what I recommend is first just starting to touch your secondary erogenous zones. So you want to maybe start to touch your arms and explore what it feels like to have your palm touching your arm, or maybe you can start to touch your legs. Um, so just focusing on like chest, arms, legs, parts of our bodies that aren't necessarily connected to um, our sexual selves, but allow us to start to increase our awareness of the sensation. So, you know, running your hands really lightly up and down your arms or on your thighs um, can feel really nice. And start to be aware and pay attention to how that feels on your body. Um, you know, not necessarily labeling a judgment with it, like, oh, I like that or I don't like that, um, or I'm neutral to that. Instead, just being present for the experience and noticing that the sensation, like even if I move my hand up my arm right here, I'm feeling sensation. And now that maybe I put my fingernails and I move the opposite way down my arm, it's a little bit of a different sensation and every single sensation comes and goes, um, but we're just being aware for each one in that present moment. So you're going to start off by, you know, exploring around your body, touching your arms, your legs, your chest, um, and then you can start to move on to touching more of our um, sexual zones of our body is what I'll call them. So maybe you start to play with your breasts or your nipples, um, and maybe you start to move your hands towards your hips, and you can kind of play around and see the sensations of running your hands over your hips, um, or maybe your lower back, or starting to touch your butt. Um, so you just kind of play again more with the sensations of your hands, bringing your attention back to your hands on your body, and that feeling when your mind starts to wander. So if you're touching yourself and you realize you're thinking about your grocery list, or the fight you had last week, or something at work, um, just bringing your attention back to the sensation in your body as you touch yourself. And that's the mindfulness practice. Um, so just like if you're mindfully eating or mindfully taking a shower and you're bringing your, your attention back to the sensations of the food in your mouth or the water on your body, you're bringing your attention back to the sensation of your hands on your body. And then you can start to explore touching your genitals. So if you've masturbated before, um, maybe you kind of go in a similar type of style and you touch yourself in that way if you really know your body. If you're not super comfortable with masturbating yet, I would start super, super slow. Be very conscious and aware here, very mindful. Um, and you can start to maybe massage your clit or touch around your vulva. Exploring your own body and what feels good to you. Um, I would avoid using any toys at this point, especially if this is the first time you're doing mindful masturbation, just use your hands. And the goal here is not to have an orgasm. The goal here is actually just to feel the sensation and feel maybe pleasure. Um, so exploring our bodies, touching ourselves, being mindful of the way that we touch ourselves and how that feels in our body. And when our minds start to wander, bringing ourselves back to that sensation. 
Um, so do that for the time that you allotted. Um, if it starts to feel pleasurable in a specific spot and you like to feel that sensation, then obviously continue to explore that spot. But if you reach a spot that isn't feeling pleasurable or it's really neutral to you or you feel like you should be feeling something and you're not, acknowledging that thought and then you know bringing yourself back to the sensation on your body um, and not getting wrapped up in the thought just saying okay that's a thought and now I'm going to bring myself back to the sensation and focusing on the sensations instead of the stories that we're telling ourselves in our head by practicing this it's going to make you more mindful and aware during sexual experiences so if your mind starts to wander with a partner you can bring yourself back to the sensations and move towards the ones that feel more pleasurable to you and it's going to enhance those sensations oftentimes during sex we can be so and even during masturbation we can be so far out in our minds we miss picking up on the subtle cues of our body and the pleasurable sensations that occur because we're so distracted by our minds so practicing being mindful and being tapping into our body and focusing on the sensations instead of focusing on what's going on up here can help enhance and make your sexual experience so much better. And mindfulness and mindful masturbation can help you practice that tool in everyday life so you can bring it into your sex life and your sexual experiences. I do want to say that masturbation can be a huge source of frustration for many people. Um, oftentimes some people don't know how to give themselves orgasms or their partners don't know how to give them orgasms. Um, and we get so wrapped up in that. And that's why I don't want you to focus on orgasm as the goal during mindful masturbation. The goal is simply just to connect with your body, connect with sensations, and potentially just move towards more pleasurable ones. But if uncomfortable or unpleasant ones pop up, acknowledging that those are just temporary and they're gonna pass, um, and trying not to get so wrapped up in those and instead focusing back on your breath, on your body, on the sensation and moving towards pleasure. So um, definitely try out mindful masturbation. I recommend honestly trying to do it once a day if possible, even if it's just for 10 minutes. Um, I think it's a great way to connect with your body, to feel more at one with yourself. Um, but if not, at least once a week, set aside time to explore your body, get in touch with yourself because it is such a wonderful form of self-care. Um, and yeah, try to explore and see how that changes the way your sex evolves over the next weeks, months, years. Um, if you become more aware of sensations, if you're more present in the moment, Mindfulness can have so many positive effects on our sex lives, just like in our everyday life. Um, and mindful masturbation is a wonderful tool that you can use to kind of unlocking those pleasurable points and also wonderful sensations and potentially orgasms in your sex life. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe. Um, let me know if you try out mindful masturbation in the comments below or DM me. Give us a follow at CVO Wellness on Instagram. We post a bunch of different sex education and sex tips and relationship advice and yoga classes on there. So definitely check that out at CVO Wellness on Instagram. Thank you guys so much for watching and hope you have a great day.